Hey friends, welcome to Montana Haven. This is the channel where you're going to find hope, inspiration, and encouragement for you and your family. On this week's video, we're here in Montana at Montana Haven, and I bet you can't wait to find out what we're going to be doing. Well, first of all, this whole house has to get clean, and it's big. And we have to wash all of these walls off. And these ceilings. Massive ceilings. washing these there's a bunch of them I'm gonna put them in the dryer and I still have a few more down there we're just gonna clean up the whole place like every nook and cranny of the whole place so that it's clean when we leave it's a good day when you can grill Oh, those chimes sound beautiful. So we're gonna have some chicken tonight. So nice to have a grill. We have to get a grill in Alaska, we don't have one. So I've been wanting to get a natural gas grill. There's a lot of propane grills available, but not very many natural gas ones. So, well, I wanted to get a used one. I haven't been able to find one. If I just buckle down and buy a new one, I guess I could find one, but you know how I am. I like to save money when I can. Hey, we'll let these sit here for a while. Come and flip them. After all that cleaning, we got to eat hearty. Yep. <laughs> There's the chicken. I think it turned out good. What's that, babe? This is just some brown butter potatoes and with seasonings and then some sourdough biscuits. Ooh. Yep. And then nice. we have some sauteed oh, yes. purple cabbage. Sauteed purple cabbage. You like that cabbage, Wyatt? Good. <laughs> Wyatt likes it. That's important. He's a food connoisseur. <laughs> Chloe, what do you have? Mm, a little puppy. Look at these little puppies that we have. Oh, isn't he cute? Mm -hmm. And then Avalon has got two over here. That little one's sleeping right there. That's another boy, and this is a little girl. These are called skipper keys. And these already have their homes. So they're about three or four weeks old, I think, four weeks, three and a half, four weeks, and they're gonna be with us for another month. And then they're gonna go to their new families. So Chloe and Avalon are just playing with them. Would you believe it? It's snowing again. Kind of like Alaska. 
Weather does whatever it wants to do. Well, today we're here in the store and we're painting some walls. Cleaning continues. What's that on the hearth? Legs? A human. Oh, okay. It's Ethan. Cleaning the mighty rack of the bull elk that I shot in 2015. Just for all you elk buffs out there, the rack scored 320 points. Which is a nice mature bull, six by seven. We're getting there, we're making progress. Well, Justin, what have you got to say for yourself? Well, okay, we're not done. Just finished the last part of this main great room, big area. And it's massive, it is tall, and it takes a long time to get all this vaulted ceiling done. The boys did super good. They got it wrapped up. Okay, Chloe, what are we grilling today? Some fish. Let me see. Ooh, some salmon from Alaska. Yay, looks yummy. In the sweet, in the sweet. Now what happened to you? When I was flossing, my tooth came out. Oh, and that's a filling. Let me see here a little bit better. Okay, hang on. Right there. Oh, there you can see. So it's a filling tooth. I see. Well, that's good. So that's the second tooth we had lost in this family in two days. <laughs> All right, good job. Well, tonight it's chicken breast. So Wyatt put them on the grill. I'm going to flip them. Like they're almost done already. Ooh. It's about another minute and they're gonna be done. This morning, Justin and I are doing a little bit of work here at our Amish farm to market store. And here's an old pile of boards that uh, we saw it a long time ago. So we actually came out and grubbed out some trim and we're gonna go, out, go in the store and do some trim work. A little cloudy this morning. It looks like it could rain. So we're gonna cover this back up again. There's a power outage this morning. So, we're gonna be working in the dark. We gotta work back here around this corner. So that's where we're gonna be working. Let's see if we can figure this out. Well, the power just now came on and we got those two boards on, that one, and we got another one cut for the bottom. So we did make some progress. All right, we had to do a little notching thing up here. Let's see if it fits. First try here. That looks like you might be able to tap in there. A little tight, a little snug. Okay, Justin, tell me what you did. I went for lunch because my feet were sore. What did you do, Justin? I put those 45 braces on. 
Just for nice. Just for cool. For grins and giggles. Okay, we got this done. Part of it done in the dark. Part of it done in the day. Now, we're going to help uh, Elvy, my brother Elvy, do some freezers. Uh, hook up some freezers, I guess. There's a monkey in that tree, hun. Do you see that monkey? <laughs> I see him. Oh, it's Wyatt. Okay. <laughs> I see him now. Well, here we are at a home I built. This is my first turnkey home in, I think, 2009 or 2010, something like that. It's here in Montana, and I'm getting uh, looking it over for the client. He's a fantastic feller, and uh, he wants me to restain it, so I'm just looking to see if it's a project we can tackle. And all that, give him a price for it. So maybe it's something we can do while we're here in Montana. Pay for our trip down or something. Make a little bit of money would be good. Been a little lean in Alaska, as you can imagine, with my with me being laid up. So that would be good to be able to get a job. So we'll see. It's a nice house. He's got a beautiful view. Beautiful view. Overlooking the creek down there. Can't really see it from here, but it's a great place. Well, today we're working in the store again, and we're going to cover up this uh, conduit that got run recently for some new coolers that we're putting along here. So Ethan and I are fixing that. Unfortunately, I got to run. I'm going to take my father-in-law to Kalispell for a doctor's appointment, getting him started here. All right, it's time to go check in on Justin and his two cousins who are hard at work. Okay, Justin, what are you guys doing here? Um, we're covering this. This uh, wall here um, with, well, this lean to with old rough sawn uh, boards. So I just cover up the junk that's inside. Yep, so I built, I built this barn with my dad when I was about 13 or 14. So I put a lot of sweat equity into that thing, but this always was a place to store trash. So then I'm gonna cover it up so it looks a little bit more presentable. I think it's a good idea. Well guys, uh, so this afternoon, you can see we're working at the store uh, with Justin and Ethan there, but this afternoon I took uh, volunteered to take my awesome father-in-law here, Ben, Benjamin Gerard, Priscilla's dad, to Kalispell for an appointment. And uh, so we doodled around there for a little bit and I, I, I got me a new hat. My old hat was worn out. I had that thing for so long, it was falling apart at the seams. It had concrete on it when I was doing my, uh, my footers at my house there in Alaska. So it's time for a new hat. So we went in a hat store and I found one, found one for dad here and I found one for myself. And uh, now we're driving home and tonight we're gonna get together with a big shindig and all of uh, all the siblings are getting together on uh, Priscilla's siblings and uh, dad and mom's, uh, my in-laws siblings, getting together at uh, one of the, the places. So. That'll be tonight. Maybe we'll capture a little bit of that. But yeah, driving through Montana, it's the appointment's about 80 miles uh, or 90 miles or so. And so kind of driving through a little bit of snow, rain, sunshine, typical spring weather here in Montana. We just got back and now I got to check to see if Ethan did this uh, little thing we we're working on and it looks like you did a fantastic job. So right there it is. There you go. There it is. So they got that all trimmed up. Boys are doing good. Now they got one more project that I told them to do. Let's go see if they got that one done. It's our deli back here. Now this is what's called the grain bin. It's got all these bulk grains and stuff in here. Oh, look at that. They did it. Good job, boys. They put a trim piece all along there. There's an electrical conduit there. They did great, just like they're supposed to. All right, it's off to home to get ready for tonight. Well, what's up, Justin? You're still working hard at it, huh? Yeah. Looks like you're making progress. Oh, you're sanding them? That's Ethan sanding them. You guys supposed to sand them? 
Oh, Grandpa wants them to sand it. Okay. That seems like a lot of work. Here we are with family. Mervyn and Mary's house. Check this food out. Good food. Good food everywhere. Beta free floor. Oh, this is okay. I'll talk to them. Good job. That's why you're here. 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 That's the rising of our savior by the time you watch this video but never never nevertheless i still want to say it uh so what a precious gift that god uh, gave with his son jesus came he died and he rose again for our sins for you and me so what a wonderful way that we can experience life uh in christ it's awesome we can experience life without him but it's not nearly as great the adventure is much greater with him so i encourage you to know him if you don't it's simple just tell him that you want to know him not complicated at all. So last night I spent the night with mom. My sister Arlene went home on the train and uh, she's with her family now in Minnesota. So now it's up to us siblings again. So I'll be doing a couple nights a week and as uh, long as I'm here. So uh, she, mom didn't have a very good night. She didn't sleep a wink the whole time I was there. So needless to say, I'm a little tired, but that's all right. It's a privilege taking care of mom. So uh, it's just, you know, grateful that we have more siblings to help with that. So uh, that's with that. And uh, Priscilla went to Kalispell with her mom today, spent some time. Uh, Kalispell is a town about 80 miles from here, just to take her there and spend some time with her. And uh, the children are all doing different things. Ethan and Justin are actually helping wash windows. We're going to work about half a day. Then they said they can go and hunt squirrels or look for shed antlers or whatever they want to do. And uh, Chloe's not feeling well this morning, so she's still in bed, unfortunately. I'm not sure she picked up a sore throat and stuff. So what I'm going to be working on this morning here for a while is we've got to get all these uh, grapevines. They just go crazy. So we've got to get them pruned up, get them ready for uh, the summertime. So that's what I'm going to be working on. So thanks for watching and uh, hope you enjoy today. Oh, yeah, I knew you would ask. You like my new hat? Well, I got it yesterday uh, when I went to Kalispell with my father-in-law. So um, it's a Stetson. 100% wool felt crushable hat. So if you guys want to know uh, what it is, that's what it is. I'll put a picture of it. You guys can find it. Maybe if I get rambunctious, I'll put a link in the description box if I find it online or something. You guys can can uh, watch it. I think it's about time to retire my other hat. I love that hat, but it's kind of like it's kind of getting worn out. So dude, this is my new look. So hope you like it. At least I think the grapes look a ton better. Got them all pruned down now. Just and Ethan were out here for a bit to help, so that's good. And uh, there's more work left to be done on the garden, but we'll uh, do it one step at a time. Justin and Ethan are now working up there on their tree house. I never made a video of building that tree house. I still have all the footage and I have to do it sometime. And I will. It was quite a feat to get that thing built. They're just sprucing it up a little bit. Now we're here at uh, my nephew's place, Joseph, my Lloyd's oldest son. And him and his wife built this cabin up here in the mountains. They're on the side of a mountain here, and they're still working on it, developing it. And they've got just Joseph and Excavator up here today doing some stuff. But yeah, you can see they're throwing some trees and they're eventually going to build a bigger house down there somewhere they have a garden down there and uh yeah just doing a homestead out here in the woods just joseph is making some food on the fire i guess okay joseph what do you call that again we call it raclette it's a french swiss cheese so joseph married a swiss girl she speaks french so they know all about this delicacies i've never had it and you pour it over 
hot potatoes and meat. Oh, it's going to be so good. So good. I can't wait. I haven't eaten since breakfast. Bye.
Meine Farmer und mein bester Freund. 